Hello Freedom Family and welcome back to Ask Orbits where your questions always will be answered. So in last episode I kinda introduced myself a little bit to you, told you a little bit where I was, where I was from. But some of you guys actually wanted to hear a little bit more. So what is there to tell? Well, my name is Alexander Obitz, I'm 23 years old. You can call me Obitz because that's what all my friends call me. And all people within the Freedom family, I assume you are my friends, right? <laughs> and if you haven't seen Brendan's aka Valorize's video, then click that eye! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry George, I always wanted to do that. So if you haven't been reading my story, then you can go to the George show and read the whole story. It's a very sad story and I didn't have a very good childhood. So if you're brave enough to read it all, then feel free to do it. But I won't go into details here in that story. But what I can tell you is that I started on YouTube the 21 of May 2015. And I joined Freedom right away because I found that as one of the first networks. I knew that they would be an amazing opportunity for me, but I had never imagined that I was standing here in front of you today, being a part of the community team and just do content for you guys. So I'm very thankful and very happy and all my love goes to George and the rest of the Freedom family. So my story on YouTube is not that simple because before I even joined YouTube, I had been studying it for about two to three years. I was sitting watching a lot of videos one day and I just thought, holy moly, this is what I want to do. I never doubted for a second that YouTube would be something for me. And I sort of gave my life to YouTube by entertaining people and make people smile. That was my goal and that is still my goal today. So what I do on my channel is simply having fun and do whatever I want to. So instead of doing a video where I don't have myself 100% in it, I rather prefer to say no to the subscribers, saying that that is simply not something for me and instead doing another video. Maybe I won't get that much fast views, but that is how I am and that is what I want. So I think freedom and the freedom spirit is a great network. A lot of great things is going to happen in the future. One of the first videos I saw on YouTube was a video by Ryan Heger. Or Nigga Heger if you want to call him that. I thought he was a great personality and he simply inspired me to do YouTube videos. Later on I found PewDiePie and that really did open my eyes for the gaming community. So I might not be as most YouTubers out there because I'm not doing one kind of content. I'm doing all kinds of different content. But enough about that guys, let's get to the program. So the first thing I want to talk about today is who is the community? Because George, he did announce some of the people from the community team. But now I want to announce all of them so far. This is the community team. All these guys are part of the community team at the moment. But I have to tell you guys, and please don't misunderstand this. We love to see all your great novels about why you should join the community team. But we simply don't take invitations anymore. We have enough people. I'm not saying that there will not be any more community members, but we have already found all the people that we need and we have a long, long list that we are going through. And when we are done with this list, there will be no more community members. But maybe in the future, I don't know. So enough about that. YouTube news. So some people might say that the fine bros really have screwed up this time. Due to their React World announcement that they did about two weeks ago, they have lost over 1 million subscribers. So some people might misunderstand this concept. So a lot of people think that if you just make a reaction video, the fine bros will come to you and require money for that video. But it's not that simple as it seems. So when you are creating a reaction video, yes, the fine pros were trying to buy the reaction word. And that has caused a lot of confusion. Because if you make a video about reactions, where you're reacting to something, either a video or something else, you might not get copyrighted for that. But if you're doing something that is so close to the elders reaction or the kids reaction or the adults reaction, then you will get copyright. But as we all know, the amount of dislikes were way too much for the fine bros. So they took down the videos and they took all their words back and now the project is no more. I mean, wow, think that they actually would buy the word reaction so that nobody could use that again. Moving on. So the first shout out we will do here on the Ask Orbit show will be Rapid Game. The first thing that caught my eye was your logo. I really like the logo you have been doing. It really stands out and is a good way to brand yourself. I would recommend you to take a look at your banner again and maybe try to improve it a little bit. And you don't have to put the YouTube web address from your channel into the banner. Just make the subscribe button into your videos and then do the annotation back to the channel so people can subscribe from there. It takes a lot of space from your banner 
Anna, you could use it more well. Also, your thumbnails, I'm very impressed. It looks very nice. However, you might need to improve your channel trailer a little bit. So you could choose to make a whole new channel trailer or maybe take one of the videos that you are really happy with and use that one as the channel trailer. When I take a look at your videos and watch your gaming, what I really see there is that you have a good microphone, your voice is very loud and clear, the quality is very good and I like to see that your gameplay is not lagging. But one of the most important things that I have to tell you and that I did notice when I came to your channel, you have no playlist. And since I can see that you have no playlist at all, you would at least have like the liked playlist if you have liked some videos. So what I can see out of this is that you're not going to many channels and like their videos. You might want to know that when you're going to other channels and you like their videos and people see that their videos are coming in your liked playlist then that could also turn into be a future friendship or a future collab because people really do appreciate when you appreciate them. So really about the gaming you should really get a playlist. Of course Freedom Family we on the community team are reading all your comments and some of the comments that I have been noticed a lot is your stories. Some of your stories are very inspiring and some of your stories are very very sad. And I will encourage you guys to upload your story on your dashboard as George told you in a previous video. Also please leave all your stories down below in the comment section. I will read them all. I love reading your stories. I would really love to interact with you guys down in the comment section here where you're from and hear your YouTube story. So just leave them down below. I will read them all. Or what do you think is a good YouTube story? Comments down below or how George is doing it. <laughs> or click that eye that will take you directly to the video where George announced this. I would like to hear what is your goal. Because if I should help you with all these tips and tricks, then I would like to hear where you're coming from. Then I would like to see your story, where you're coming from, and afterwards see what is your goal. What do you want to get out of this? And what do you think freedom can help you with? Because I really would love to give you a million tips and tricks in order for you to become successful here on YouTube. So if you haven't watched the first episode of Ask Obits, then click that eye. That will take you to that video. I'm sorry, Joss, but I will use this forever. It's simply too good. <laughs> I really hope that you enjoyed this second episode of Ask Opitz. There will be a lot more and I will try to upload two times a week. Don't hang me up on that one. I will try, okay? <laughs> and if you want to see more of me, then head over to my YouTube channel and see what I love doing. But for now guys, thank you so much for watching. Remember, you can always ask Opitz questions and I will always try to answer them the best way possible. Can you hear? This is what I have to deal with. Stop it! Stop it! Simply stop it! Oh my god, the construction is starting again. So, for now guys, stay groovy out there and have an awesome time!